What's up guys, it's Ralph Misha and welcome to another video. Today I've got the Galarian Slowbro V Forces tin here. I do have a Lucario one as well, but that might be one that I open off camera. Um, I've been made aware that I didn't have to open everything on camera. Um, in fact, I recorded a video before this and uh, you could I could hear how unhappy I was when I was recording it so I decided to not upload it so that's why there's been a gap in uploads but this is the Galarian Slowbro V tin um, there's also a Lucario V and a Mew V in the set here that um, recently came out um, the only one I didn't pick is the Mew because I already have the Mew um, there is the back of it if you would like to read it apologies for the ring light glare I'll try and there you go should be able to read it now, mostly. Uh, we do get four packs in here. So I'm going to crack this open and we are going to have a look inside. So here's everything that we get. Of course, we get the tin with glaring sober on it, which is pretty cool. I'll put that off over here somewhere. We do get the promo, which isn't actually a promo. Uh, it's not a specifically promo numbered card, as you'll see down here. It is actually just the straight up out of Darkness Ablaze uh, printing of Glaring Slow Brovy. And it is hugely off center. Um, it's fine for me. I'll probably play it well. Actually, I don't think I even have this in Darkness Ablaze. So I'll probably put this one just in my set binder. But Glaring Slow Brovy is a decent card. It's seen play in uh, Eternatus builds with the poison variety. So we do get the code card to redeem the Glare and Slow V online which I am actually going to keep for myself sorry guys I do have a tin of promo of uh, code cards next to me there which I will be giving out during the video and then of course we have four packs we have Breakpoint X-Ray Breakpoint they've stopped putting evolutions in tins like this now uh, because they realize evolutions is probably because they realize evolutions is a hot set one sword and shield base and two uh, Vivid Voltage, so we will go in release order as we always do. So we start with the XY Breakpoint with the shiny Mega Gyarados on the front. Uh, actually, just as I'm recording this, uh, we've just had the Pokemon Go Kanto tour. Um, so, uh, got loads of shinies and things. Um, and <laughs> unfortunately my other half got another shiny Magikarp even though there's been a shiny Magikarp community day so he got also two shiny Mewtwo's though so so this set XY Breakthrough uh, not really much to talk about Froakie the Greninja from this set was amazing at the time um, but we're probably just gonna go through this pretty quickly Puzzle of Time it's one of the cards that was banned I'm gonna put that one to the side uh, it's banned and expanded Got a reverse Psyduck, which is pretty cool. And our rare is a Shift Street non holo rare. So, for the most part, that set for me is bulk. Um, I don't really collect it. Um, I'm actually going to give away the code card for Breakthrough as well. Uh, Breakpoint, sorry. So, there you go, take that one. Um, these are the sets I'm more interested in the X and Y, uh, the S Sword and Shield sets. Uh, X and Y is two blocks ago now, like two whole eras ago. It's crazy to think that, right? That X and Y was so long ago. <laughs> um, but you know, even thinking back to Sun and Moon, Sun and Moon was quite a long time ago now. So we're we're already in the second uh, Sword and Shield block. Well. As of this recording, we're not in it yet. Uh, Shining Fates is the only set we've had this year, which there will be videos of uh, coming up. Um, but obviously we've got Ma Matchless Fighter coming up soon. Um, so that'll be our first set of the year for Sword and Shield. We've got regular rare at Santa Scorch there. So nothing to write home about with those. Hopefully we'll get some out of Vivid Voltage. I've really not opened a lot of Vivid Voltage. Uh, the video that I didn't upload was um, a opening of the Vivid Voltage check lane blisters. Um, partially because there's only two, uh, it's two packs. So uh, I feel like I'm kind of wasting your time with that. 
Also, I didn't actually get anything good and I was so demotivated when I did it. Um, I figured I would just ignore it. So, Vivid Voltage, uh, still a difficult set to get hold of here. So these tins are probably the best way we can get hold of them right now. But uh, there's a reverse Chatot. And our rare is a Grapplocked V. Grapplocked V, I'm joking. It's just a Grapplocked. <laughs> All these cars are off-center as well, guys, apart from the... Well, even the reverse is off-center. Um, so that's uh, a little bit frustrating. Um, the print runs haven't been great for the most recent... So that's another thing as well. They're, like, rushing to get stuff out, so the print quality is going down. Um, I mean, specifically with Shining Fates... I don't know what the print quality for that is like yet. I haven't opened any of it up yet. But they rushed to get that out. Uh, they shipped it by air, which cost Pokemon quite a lot of money to do. So I guess we'll see the quality of them when I start opening them. But we have a reverse Aracuda. And our final rare is going to be a Togekiss VMAX. I'm actually pretty happy with that. Um, I didn't expect to get anything great out of it and getting a VMAX is really nice. I don't actually think I have this. I'm almost certain I don't have it. Um, I will let you have a look at it and let you read it uh, if I can get it into focus. So there we go. So Max Glide for two colorless does 120 and you can search your deck for up to two cards and put them into your hand and shuffle your deck afterwards. And he has free retreat as well. I've seen people trying to make this card work. Uh, stuff like Welder, maybe uh, lightning support etc uh, I just don't think it hits hard enough um, and it has a weakness to lightning as well which is a bit of a problem but really really nice actually um, I will give you a code card to uh, say thank you so um, let's give you this one there we go sword and shield rebel clash three pack Rayquaza so this was a code card uh, that my friend sort of sold to me, sold me a load of them. So, but that is going to be it for this one, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. Of course, if you did, please be sure to leave a like, subscribe if you're new on here. Feel free to share this video with your friends. If you think you know somebody who may also enjoy watching a video like this, check out the videos in the description below. I will be leaving playlists. Um, I was going to do a Players Cup 3 playlist, but I've decided against that. Players Cup 3 is going to be a series that is exclusively on Twitch, uh, mainly because editing and rendering those videos is taking too long and too much power. It's costing me too much money to do it. And physically, it's costing a lot of electric. So um, come and join me on Twitch for the live streams of the Players Cup 3. Um, this is going to be going up at probably um, on the 22nd or 23rd. Um, so this will be up either Monday or Tuesday, probably Tuesday. At which point, uh, come and join me for the live stream on Wednesday, 7pm UK time, twitch.tv slash rebelformation94. The link will be in the description below. We will be playing the rest of our keys throughout the week to qualify for Players' Cup 3. We have seven keys left and we are playing them with Eternatus VMAX. So come and join me. Come and talk about the state of Pokemon. Come and have a laugh, a cry, whatever. It's a really crappy situation right now. So just come and join me and talk about whatever you want to talk about. Um... I like to say my, my stream is a safe place. You can talk freely about whatever you want to talk about there. But that is going to be it for this one, guys. Thank you very much for watching. I will see you in the next video. Peace.